Hello everyone, it's the professional scumbag here, back again in Fallout New Vegas. Um, last time we, uh, we summoned Satan, and Satan just completely erected the strip. I agree they are. And, uh, yeah, after a, a restart and some diddle daddling around, I, everything's fine now, it appears. That wall still keeps appearing there, because it's like, Hey, remember in the old game when New Vegas was like split up into three three hundred thousand places because it was built for dumb Xbox things that can't handle more than two NPCs at a time. Sorry, Xbox users, but goddamn, those, those things are terrible. I'm sorry. This is like, yeah, this 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 isn't supposed to be here because it's it's not sectioned off anymore in my game. <laughs> Yeah, now we're, uh, we're, I think, what I was going to do now is go and talk to, uh, Ambassador Crocker. Get a mission from the NCR. You know, get in good with their books. And I'm already pretty good with their good books. I mean, I look like one of them. I am a normal NCR soldier. You cannot convince me otherwise. Never mind me and my squad of... Okay, my squad's a little bit sketchy. Don't you judge me, military policeman. Don't you judge me. I kissed you on the shoulder. Hello, Hello travel one. Who would have thought on on that? this would exist? Everyone's talking at the same time, I don't like it. Squeaky chair, I've had enough of your shit. Hell, ma'am. Welcome to the NCR Embassy. How can I help you? I'm looking for Ambassador Crocker. Ambassador Crocker can be found in his office through the door to my right and at the end of the hall. Goodbye. I was wondering if we had a quest for it, but I don't know. Wait, Sierra Madre? Cool, Sierra Madre. It's a nice place. We will, we'll go there eventually. And also, if you're wondering, I'm uh, I'm being super professional and and checking the messages that my friend is sending me. And apparently he was watching one of the videos, one of the other Fall of New Vegas videos, the ones I've actually posted. But at that time, which is a long time ago, now because I'm probably gonna take a while to post all of these because I'm super lazy. And he's just like mistakes. Oh, make. I have something I wanted to discuss with you. It's a mm -hmm. very important matter, and I have a strong feeling you're the perfect person for the job. I don't know what you want, but I'm not interested. No, I'm listening. I'm sure you've noticed that things are a little tense around here with all the issues between the NCR, the Legion, and Mr. House. It doesn't take a genius to see that something big is going to happen soon. To be honest with you, the NCR is in a tight spot. But if we fail now, it's the people here that are going to suffer the most. I'm not willing to let that happen. And I don't think you're the kind of person that would either. You got my attention. To the northeast is a settlement. The locals here call them boomers. They are sitting on a munition stockpile that would be invaluable. That does not seem safe. I would like you to get in contact with them, and then do whatever it takes to convince them to help us. Unfortunately, the boomers keep to themselves and are, let's say, hostile to all outsiders. That's why I need someone like you. Someone with your background and reputation would have a better Are you chance typing of everything you say? Anyone I have available. In exchange for your help, you will receive complete amnesty for any past crimes against the NCR, as well as additional benefits and perks. Do you think you would be able to do this for me? 
I'll find him and I'll talk to him and I'll kill every last one of them. Much appreciated. Once you've talked to them, come back. Just grab that last part, sir. I'm not gonna play caravan with you, or else. Goodbye. I hate caravan. It's the worst game ever. Okay, and then we got plenty of other quests. We're actually gonna act finally get on to the New Vegas bounties. Wait, didn't I? No, I did not. It was with another. Okay, I spy with my little eye. You get a shot in the face. Don't mind that. I didn't just shoot inside your embassy. Yeah, with another character, I killed the the one bounty guy, and then I just like I just was stuck. No, I or I, I uh, didn't turn in or I turned in the 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 finger to uh, the guy, but I didn't instantly go into the next thing, which is what they usually was. Convince the boomers. The boomers are not there. Oh, okay, yeah, the whole thing with the Power Rangers. Okay. Sorry, just still checking that conversation that I should not be checking, considering. Yeah. You know, yeah, beautiful. At first I thought he was scary, but he then he wasn't. Okay, Gamora, calm your tits. I mean, I know, I know that's like your major selling point, but calm them. Uh, get it? Get it, Securitron Mark II? Mark II? Get it? Get it? I'm gonna kill you, boss. Those are just popping in now, no one, nobody knows. That guy was not there before, but now he's here. Wait, you're a cop. Why are you a, you're a Mark One? Why are you a Mark One? Enjoy all the Vegas Strip has to offer. Oh, you poor, poor bastards! You didn't get upgraded. this for reasons yes yes exterminate exterminate Daleks 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 Thank you for visiting in Vegas. yep I got myself a souvenir I'm good and slam dunk welcome up oh. Them. That's what you get. Does when I have a riot? When did I have a? How long have I had a riot shotgun? Okay, riot shotgun. I'm your best friend. Okay, now is the map marker intelligent? Yes, it is. All right, we're going to Crimson Caravan Company, and then we're going to walk from there. I have not gone in that direction yet. As of now, though, this is going to be good. How long have I been awake? Don't know. A while. Got up at seven ish. B -b a bit before seven, and now it is the mid. It's twenty past midnight. I've been waiting for a bit. Hold on. No. Yeah, quickly is over. No, he's over in. He's in this general area. Yeah. Okay. And I'm just gonna forget about quickly. Quickly. I'll, I'll 
catch up with him, kill him, take his finger, bring it back to the guy. You know, I think I actually, like, once I get a, wit a bit through, I'm just gonna do all of the New Vegas Bounty stuff. Because uh, there's New Vegas Bounties 1 and 2, and I can just do them all in one fell swoop. Why is this on? That's a massive waste of power. Ow. It's also bright. And it hurt my eyes. On the road again. All my hotkeys are gone. Yes, they are. Alright, we're back at business! Make mistakes, friend. Ah, ah, ooh, ah, no, oh no. Ow. Where's the mother land? Where's the mother land? Because I'm German. <laughs> the legend never dies! Why is your odd name for the legend? The legend never dies. Hold on. I need a ranged weapon. Slam and German! Look, Slam and German! Good job, balls. Balls, you're my favorite dog. He's balls, talking dog. He's gonna eat your freaking face. Balls, the talking dog. He's an absolute psychopath. You know why they call him balls? Because that's what he bites first. George, are you just sort of like here? Not like actually part of the group. You're just sort of. I think. Okay. You guys, you just, just murder everyone. I will loot everyone. That's a good strategy. Oh, I'm right at my 180. Note to self, don't pick anything up, even if it looks really valuable. Or anything that actually weighs anything. George, you scare me. I'm sure you're going to betray us at some point. You're beautiful. Alright. Next step next. We go to place and then we explode. Because they're boomers and the boomers explode. Because that is why they boomers. Because they called boomers because they bloom boom boom boom. I don't e speak English, you know. I only speak the no nonsense, you know. Bow, the talking dog. Ah, fail. I see those robots on the strip are running around with different faces or something. Don't ask, because I don't know. Hmm. Congratulations. Hello. I just want to see. One. Two. Where's Steve? I'm just running around with three. Three El Chest Breach companions. I'm the ter I'm a terrible person. For some reason. Good. Squawky. You take his eyes out? Good. Hold on, I need this waypoint. Slam jams. Pfft, silly game. Fields can't own shacks. Shacks own fields. Wait. I've been mistaken this whole time. Later. I'm wrong. Oh god. I've been made a fool of. Whoa there, pal. You better slow down, or you'll get blown up like the rest of the idiots who thought they'd scavenge in Boomer territory. Now that I've got your attention, little do you know I am an idiot. Information. It'll cost you, but it's well worth the investment. Tell me, or you can tell the underside of my boot. He's a very, very good conversationalist. Whoa, simmer down. I'll tell you, I'm a gambler and a scavenger. I've made some cash from gambling and some cash from reclaiming goods that are no longer being used. Looting dead bodies. Now, do you want my help or not? Thanks for the warning. Let's pass the sign. Oh, lordy, lordy. You haven't heard of the boomers? I did. What rock have you been living under? 
They were a bunch of artillery slinging, grenade lobbing odd jobs. Camping they out sling in artillery at you? Wander into their territory, and you're as good as me. imagine they throw a howitzer at you. It's like in Monty Python where they throw the, the Trojan bunny out over just like a howitzer. <laughs> okay. So, where do you get. Uh, there is a way, and I'll tell you. For a little wager. Let's hear it. Well, I know the secret to get past. If you give me the caps, I'll tell you. If you make it back alive, I'll double your money. Um. Yes, uh, you got yourself a deal. Okay, here you go. That page has the details, but it's all in the timing as you move from building to building. I'll be here watching, so I'll know if you've made it to the gate or not. Remember, there's 600 caps in it if you make it. Oh, my poor, poor man. You don't realize. I have quick save. Plus, I'm probably just going to make it, because, like... This is immensely easy. Though, this is the scariest thing ever. The, when I, I didn't even know the boomers were here the first time I came through. And I, I, heard, I just heard the sound, and I'm just like, Oh, no! I'm on fire. Mistakes have been made. I'm stuck. I'm not going the right way. So for some reason, I thought, hey, I want to go the hard way. Little did I know, that means you get kills. Okay. Mistakes were made, and that's why I'm going to go the cheap way. Because you see, the boomers, they fire, in, in, they fire throughout the, the town. So if you hog the wall... They don't actually fire close enough to you. Bull! And before they catch up to you, you're already close enough to their gates that they don't fire. Oh, Axe Man's dead. And Veronica's dead. Beautiful. Who else did we lose? Balls, George, Steve, you're okay? Yeah. What, what? I beat you guys, I beat you guys, you get rich, get rich, get, 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 get erect, hey, get erect, I'm already erect. Hold it right there, don't you move. I like their armor. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? Uh, simple, run, hide, run, hide, it's all in timing. But I had you zeroed in the whole time, nobody's that fast. He's laser focused in! I really wish that, like, whenever I said that reference, anyone, like, it could possibly be understood what it was from, but. It's a lot more funny in context. It's a lot less funny out of context. Like everything I say. I ain't come here to attack you. Then just. just stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. Okay. I'll take this from here. You've literally meant any second. And hello, Mr. Pole. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wishes to speak to you. I want to meet her mom. Then I can shout, Mother of Pearl! Okay. Alright, lead the way. Follow close, and mind your behavior. Okay. I'll be your bestest friends. Welcome, child. Took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? I've been waiting a good five years for an outsider to come along and visit. You didn't exactly roll the red carpet. Those howitzers of ours aren't just for entertainment, child. Explosive ordnance is what keeps the savages at a distance. Except you. There's something special about you, child. And it was the howitzers... I have three intelligence. To show it. Or four intelligence. Oh, so many ways. Small ones to begin with, so we can get used to what it's like to have a sav uh, 
uh, outsider around and about. Should that go well, it may be you can help in big ways, too. We'll have to see. How can we trust to kind of keep secrets? You have to keep in mind that you're our first contact with the outside world since I was barely a woman. Oh Supposed god, was that hundreds of years ago? But the world around us is changing. Neon lights in the distance. Patrolling robots, soldiers. My youngers think our guns can keep out the world. But I think we need to let it in, just a little, or become its victim. You're that little bit of the world. Are you saying I'm fat? Welcome to Nellis. Where do I start? Any quest, quest markers, Lady Quest Markers. For we're swimming in problems. My youngers can tell you all about it. Raquel could use help with the bug problem. Doc Argyle has wounded he's tending to. And Loyal and Jack might be looking for Loyal's help with a stupid name. Hairs. Or you could just go see Pete at the museum and hear the story of our people. All you have to do there is listen. Come and go as you like, help or don't help, I leave it up to you. But I hope you'll show my youngers that not every outsider needs to be blown up. Watch your step, sister. Hello. Actually, man, did you just twitch? Just twitch. X-Man's losing it! Guys! George! George! If he starts losing it, you grab him, and hopefully he'll kill you in the time it takes us to run away. Okay? That's the plan. George, were you crippled? Come on, George. It's a few howitzers. How it is a few... It was only a few howitzers. See, I'm fine. I'm moonwalking. I'm practically moonwalking. George, you're a wuss. Or Jorge. I'm gonna call you Jorge now. Uh... Okay. What's your step, why is someone calling me sister? I'm scared now. Why is there a... Oh, come on. Do I really need a minus to my intelligence right now? That's plus one luck. Um, range, what's my minus to luck? Or to intelligence? Oh, I'm meant to ask withdrawal. Oh, that's that all. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna talk to the doctor. Okay. But first, first things first. Volar. 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 Is this no? That's the schoolhouse. This is the medical station. All right. Wait. 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 Where are my medical skills? Thirty. Y'all hear beeping? Hey, it's over here? I don't know, it's beeping. I know Mother Pro is letting you wander Nellis as you please, outsider. But I have patience to tend to. Hey, medical treatment. I'm afraid medications are in short supply. Maybe you should... Okay, I'm trying to make myself useful. I have three patients here who were gravely injured fighting those giant ants in the generator building a few days ago. I've stabilized their wounds, but they're in bad shape. Do you have medical training? I assume the ants do uh, tipular nasties pierce the par uh, patient's anterior tracks. Well, I don't know, actually. I suppose it's possible. You should take a look. And that's why you never let... Yeah, it looks like... Leave him alone. Okay. Do I have anything useful? Doctor's bag is not what I need. I need... I can't remember what it's called. I know in Fallout 3 it's uh, the DC medicine blah de blah de blah de blah But... Wait, fixer might help. Uh, 
how does that work? Because medicine is at 36, which is not high enough to save anyone's life. Do I have any BS things I can throw on? Agility? No. Bad resistance? No. Anything for intelligence? Speech plus five. That's not helpful at all. Okay. I can't actually help any of these people. Because 40 is the lowest. You look scary. Hello. You terrorist, you're terrorist. I don't trust. I don't negotiate with those people. Terrorists, that is. Nobody negotiates with them. I can't tell where I'm supposed to be going. Where is the museum? Museum is one of the easiest ways to boost your uh, standing with the boomers. Hold on. I need to turn on the charm. Charisma plus one. And then, wait, what's the other plus? Speech plus five is Julie plus one. I don't know how to dust her. Let's go with that one. Or else we could go with the charmer. I can't. You're the outsider. Mother Pearl sent word that you'd be stopping by. You must be eager to hear the story of our people. Toads we goats. Totally. Yep. Wonderful. I'm sure you've noticed the mural. On I the actually wall didn't, because I kind of just came in. It all means? Yeah. That's about the time. Excellent. Imagine you're the first outsider to ever hear our tale. <clears throat> That's not how you'd say that. It's you'd say it like. Hold on, I'm just gonna pause. It's like, imagine you're the first one to see our t hear our tale. But he's like, imagine you're the first one to hear our tale, as if I had to imagine that, but I don't have to imagine because I am the first outside. I'm sorry. What nice people. Ages ago, long before I was born, we lived underground. Everyone had guns, but the overseer wouldn't let us explode anything, not even a hand grenade. We left and wandered the wastes. They were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades, burned them with flamethrowers. It was neat, but there was a downside. For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost... You don't want to know what happened to the other .4 of a savage. We needed Nellis. <laughs> Here we have prospered and multiplied. Here are mighty guns to destroy any savages might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Well, until... But... Not saying you want to harm us, or you're a savage, but... Anyways... Nellis has revealed many secrets. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once faced to, and it has taught us where to find one. And that is our story so far. For this last image, is our future. To restore the bomber, to fly the open skies in armored safety, running high explosive ordnance upon ignorant savages. This is our destiny. I'm pleased that you listened to the entire story. Perhaps there are details like you'd like to know more about. Let me know. How can I help you, outsider? Yeah, Gosh, that. There's a lot of folks. Argyle's our doctor. He could use help tending to any Over at the workshop, Loyal and Jack are always building something. The Loyal may not be too happy to see your kind running around Nellis. My kind? What's that supposed to mean? Me? I'm Pete, keeper of the story. I know I seem kind of young. I was the apprentice keeper of the story until a couple months ago. But old keeper Don, well, whiskey and landmines don't go together. Oh, they so don't? <laughs> I bet you want to know everything about us. Wait, can I... Why can I not... Hello. How can I help you, outsider? Bye! But... 
Why can I not ask you further? How could I help you outside? I think I'm too stupid to do it. With my other character, I got into like a whole conversation like I want it. I did it. I got it now. And I'm over encumbered. Thus is the karma. Please don't crash the game. I'm wearing two gas masks at the same time. That looks stupid. Yeah, with my other character, I was like... I was able to talk about all sorts of stuff. Like, giving him ideas and, like, asking him more in-depth questions and stuff. And every time I did that, I got more fame with the boomers. Maybe I am too stupid. I mean, I only have three intelligence. Or, four intelligence. Three when I have my Mentaz withdrawal. Which is not fun.